Hey everybody, Andy here from We All Around Gaming coming at you with part whatever of my Pokemon Crystal Let's Play. In the last episode, we got to Indigo Plateau. In this episode, we are going to do a few errands and then take on the first member of the Elite Four, I believe. That's, that's my plan. So, I took the liberty of leveling up my pokes. Always want to have your starter a little bit higher level than the others. So, and I also taught Elgato Thunder. I went to the Goldenrod Game Corner and did that. Um, Z I taught Zippo Flame Wheel, so it's time to actually evolve him. And while I'm thinking about it, let's teach Tauros Earthquake. So, um, Earthquake is. I deleted Surf on him already. I took him to the move deleter. So there we go, that's one thing out of there. Now, let's evolve Zippo. A lot of people are waiting for this. I've been waiting for it too, so he won't suck now. Uh, here we go, Firestone. What? Zippo is evolving. And let me just tell you, Arcanine is a really awesome Pokemon. Spoiler, spoiler, he evolves into Arcanine. Just look at that, it's just like freaking cat. Or dog. I don't even know, but it's awesome. It looks awesome too. Let's look at the stats. Um, Zippo, where are you down here? Stats. Where are the stats? There, there. Look at that attack stat and that special attack. They're godly. And Pidgeotto is one level away from evolving, so. Why not use this epic rare candy? Level 36. Now, take a look at those stats right now. Look at that 60 attack. And here we go. Evolution. Revolution. Congratulations. Your Goku evolved into Pidgeot. Let's look at the stats now. Now that I know how to find the stats. Went up 14 points. Wow. That's not terrible. I think it's time to challenge the Elite Four. But first, I need to buy items because I'm a little bit under equipped. So I'm gonna buy some items, and you're gonna notice I don't have a lot of money. So I have to do this. Carefully. Revives are w super necessary. You could not do this without revives. I need 10. And now I need to buy some. I'm going to spend the rest of my money on hyper potions. I'm going to buy 10. I'm going to buy. Ooh, this. 12 Hyper Potions. And... 2 Full Heals. Wow, I'm out of money. And I guess I'm going to spend the rest on... Hyper Potions. Ooh, I can barely buy 2 more. Okay! Let's challenge the first member of the Elite Four. I'm actually going to... Arrange my team accordingly. Let's see here. Um, how do I want to do this? Alrighty, I figured out how I want to do this. The first to go, first up, is Elgato. Alrighty, let's challenge the Elite Four. And there's no turning back from the Elite Four. Once you go in, you are in there forever. This is the first guy. I always thought he was kind of weird. Welcome to the Pokemon League, Andy. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Will. I have trained all around the world, making my psychic Pokemon powerful. And at last, I've been accepted into the Elite Four. I can only keep getting better. Losing is not an option. You'll see why I led with Jolteon. Um... Because he has Psychic Pokemon, but 
Psychic Pokemon can also be dual types. And yes, he leads off with a Zatu, which is Psychic Flying. So, I'm going to blast it with a Thunder, if I can hit. Yes, first Thunder hit. That's a great way to start the Elite Four. Wow, one hit KO. I'm kind of surprised. Wow, Gato. Wow, I'm surprised. I didn't think that was going to kill. So now we're just going to send out Jinx. And this is a perfect time to test out... I love testing out my new Pokemon because we're now we're super strong. We're at max power right now. We're at like we were at like a V6 before, and now we're like a V8. Don't hate. This is Zapo. He's got an Afro. And ooh, I can use. I want to use Flame Wheel. So he's gonna need Double Slap. Meh. Nothing. Zippo is kind of defensive. And this is the wheel move I was talking about. It's Flame Wheel, and it's slightly more stronger than Ember. Because Zippo does not learn flame. I don't think it learns flamethrower. And look, that did. That's gonna be a two hit KO. Double slap again in the Elite Four. Come on, that's child's play. Come on. And there we go. That should be the KO. Yup, solid two hit KO. And there's the EXP. I'm a little bit under level for the Elite Four. I have to admit, but. It's necessary. So he's gonna sound like, oh, I don't know what to do. Uh, I guess, well, see, the thing about Zippo now, or not Zippo, Elgato, is it knows Thunder. But Thunder is an extremely unreliable move. It has a 30% chance to miss. I'm gonna use Thunder again. And I hit again! Total. Let's see, can it one hit KO? It does! Oh my gosh, Elgato is just killing him! Ooh, kill him! Executor. Ooh, I know how to use for that. This guy. I'm gonna see if I can get a Fury Chain, or Fury Cutter Chain going here. Because those are fun. I like those. Fury Cutter, go! It's four times super effective. Leech Seed. Ah, that kind of sucks, but whatever. Leech Seed, if you don't know, sucks health from the from your opponent every time it attacks. They changed that in later generations to, to do it at the end of the turn. So, hopefully I can live this Psychic. I think I can. I think I can. I probably won't live this next Leech Seed. I didn't do the math in the last one. But it's okay, I have I have a couple revives. And I don't think Deet's gonna be Oh it killed so it doesn't matter. Um yeah, I'm gonna switch actually. Oh, I don't know. I Theoretically I should be able to hit th three in a row. I mean I guess it's my only option. I mean, yeah. Can I hit uh, three thunders in a row? This has it's like the same accuracy as focus but I wouldn't be mad if I missed this, to be honest. I, oh my god, he hit. Oh my gosh. The now I have to worry about PP too, because I've used three thunders and wow, 36. Look, look at that special attack. Let's see this. Wow, 92. That's not bad. I'm trying to learn pin missile. Hell no. Actually, maybe. Is there anything that I would like to delete? Nah. Yeah. Stop learning pin missile. So, I believe I only suffered minor damage. And, uh, here's the thing. I didn't expect, I expected this to be much longer, and I expected to end the episode after this. But, I have been proven wrong. My team kicked his team's ass. Excuse my language, but that's the only word I can use to describe what just happened. So, but the funny thing is, I just remembered I have to go somewhere, and I'm late. So, I'm going to have to end this episode right here. I'm sorry that it's kind of short, but I just remembered I have to be somewhere. I know it sounds kind of bad, but it's the truth. So, thank you so much for watching, and as always, deuces.